Hey guys, so I know it's been a while since I really, really came on. I know I came on and I did um, just a little bit of a video with um, baby Serena and um, but I have baby Kings in here and I want to give him a baba. Well, I'm gonna make sure I had a little bit of and I wanted to try to feed him if he will take his baba. Sometimes he doesn't want the there we go. So and of course you see Mia hanging out here. But there's a reason I have them both here. Um gosh, this he is being fussy tonight. Thing is is that he prefer to be breastfed but I am not breastfeeding him <laughs> I'm just kidding guys I don't breastfeed him but um so I of course you guys know I am in rehab but I've been looking at quite a bit of babies and I've decided that I think I really really want another baby eventually so I have a question for you guys and this is really a serious question. <laughs> Uh-oh. Trying to... All right. So my question for you guys is... Uh-oh, me, Mia. Poor little Mia. Let me... Sheesh. All right, guys. Let me get her situated. I just don't want her... All right. Now he's going to get all upset about this. Are you going to get upset because mama keep messing up your bottle? I guess you don't mind. Alright, so the question is for you guys is, tell me what you think about babies with jointed heads versus non-jointed heads. Like, and uh, let me explain. Alright, Kingston is poured basically in one piece with his head is jointed and it's attached right versus Mia is poured in all one piece she has no joints no seams in the neck area or head area at all I'm just curious what you guys think is you know like if you had a choice which one you would prefer would you prefer the one with the jointed head or the one with all in one piece? Now, I don't want to like give too much of my opinion or thought process on it because I would like to hear what you guys have to say first because I don't want to influence you guys' comments because I really want to know what you guys think about that because... I have been going back and forth with it and sometimes it's good to get other people you know thought process on it so um, because I am eventually gonna get me another baby I think um, so yeah if you guys would answer that question in the comments below it would be nice um, I'm going to show you the both of them. Alright. Let me burp him. Oh my gosh. I just love him to pieces. I'm telling you. It's a mama baby. Alright. So, like I said, he is a full body silicone. He has a jointed neck see he has a jointed neck head or whatever you should say and he is mama's favorite little boy <laughs> so we have him and then we have baby baby Mia and baby Mia as you can see, let's see, 
Baby Mia doesn't have, she's all in one piece, and so her neck is like this. Sorry. So that's her neck. She's so tiny. It's like I have to get her really close for you guys to see. But yeah. So that is Mia. So you do have to support her head because it will, you know, it will wobble, wobble, wobble. So that is Mia. So that is what the full body in one piece. Now, okay, I'm not going to say because I don't want to influence you guys on that. So that is my question of the day for you guys. If you would comment below and let me know which one you prefer and why. And what do you think is the best one? Because I'm kind of torn between the two. I've seen... There's two babies out there that I've seen. And one has jointed and one has non-jointed. And I'm just curious on what you guys think about that. And then we'll talk about it in the next video. So I'll see you guys later.